pull bar. Hey, get down. Get down, this is my package. We already destroyed one box from where it's supposed to last night. Shit all over the floor. Got a mop. Huh. Crazy. Hmm. The old expo. Here, we'll wait for Ernie to get here to open the actual package. Two seconds for you. Two seconds. One more. One more. We have boxes everywhere chewed up. Let's not do another one right now. You get one later. Let's have a little restraint. You're gonna ruin all the finer things. Hey, it's a trap. Oh, those are treats. Get out of here. That's it. No. That's a good man. Man. So this morning has been a little uh, annoying. Actually, it's been the past couple of days trying to deal with like getting a new rental car for the mountain. So we've been, everyone's always tweeting me and telling me I should use Turo, T-U-R-O. But honestly, so far, <laughs> Not impressed, not impressed at all. They took money from me and then told me that I wasn't approved to drive the car. There's really absolutely no reason that I'm not approved to drive a car. I know I don't drive a lot, but I can drive like a motherfucker. It's really annoying and I'm kinda over it. So that's what I've been doing early this morning, me and Ern trying to get that situated. Also trying to figure out if I can fly with Omar to New York City, cause I would prefer to, but we'll see if that actually happens. And um, then I've been drawing all night. <laughs> Drawing, 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 drawing. Another day on earth, alive, living and breathing. But let's get it. Whee! Omar shit is fucking cake. They'll oh, send yeah. it in like four days with a vest, paperwork. It's, it's normal. Nobody's gonna say anything. Yeah. They don't care. Yeah, I mean, what are they gonna You're do? You're in first class. He's yeah. not gonna be misbehaving. You at least have a big area for him to be in. Yeah, you can just sit under my feet. Close, close to the ledge, so. <laughs> Um. Oh, so there's a. Yesterday we forgot to watch the new Bad Baby video, so I waited for you to watch it. All right, nice. I haven't even seen it yet. What is this? That's the. Uh, yeah, I haven't opened them out of here yet. I unboxed them, but I haven't opened them out of here. I wait. I saw Alt Press wrote on Bad Baby, and they were like, why are. <laughs> Why is she still around and why are we still writing it? Like why are people including us still writing about it? It's funny it? to me that people haven't realized that it it does not matter what you think about something. Yeah. It matters that you think about something. Yeah. That's it. Like that, that is the key. Like it doesn't yeah. matter. Like for you typing that comment into the fucking comments right now telling me I'm fat and ugly and you wish I would die. It doesn't matter. I got you to think about me, bitch. Like I don't know how they haven't figured this out yet. You know yeah. what I mean? It's like, he, it's the same because thing. Because then like, to monetize it though, is when you gotta take the positive end of it, I think. Because the people that are thinking negative aren't gonna buy shit. Although they might. But you can still get monetized, like ads yeah. and shit like that. Like, yeah, sure, just the like, fact that not, people are looking at your yeah, shit. Yeah, I'm not selling merch to the fucking dudes that don't like me, but it doesn't, that doesn't matter. Like, you're not doing it for them. Hey, I'm out. But that ain't what I'm about. I'm running up commas and plays. So stop a bitch out in my J's. She's always referencing Jay's though, I'm over it. Yeah. But I never needed him anyway. She's rocking Carl Kanai. I know, I was just gonna say that. It's like uneventful to me. It's fine, but I don't love it or anything. Yeah, me neither. It's but not it's memorable not like the first one. Yeah. I wonder if the first one's just memorable because it's so shocking. Nah, nah. Because High Bitch is also memorable. Yeah, that's true. White Jade, white Porsche, white wrist. I get this bitch in some boots though, for real. Fucking, I'm gonna fucking completely celebrate Danielle Bergoli's entire catalog. By the time she's 30, I'm gonna have it. Like, y'all don't even remember Hi Bitch. It's Jay shit. I think the same thing with Kodak. I always see him in the in the Florida, the Gators. She's... It's residual. It's residual. I know. I'm blessing with them green and orange ultra boosts. It might change a man's life. Mm -hmm. He had that line about not wanting no Yeezys. You know, yeah, because he's got too much sauce. I'm nervous my... about the show, dude, because I think, you know how usually I go to shows and I fucking, like, love it. I see a live show and I'm a fan of them. Mm. I saw some footage, man. It's tough. Anybody you know? want to protect Ern at the Denver Kodak Black show? No, I don't mean like that. I don't mean like that. I'm talking about it's tough. Like, like the, Why the... are you yelling? I get hype. I'm pissed off because they, they play the backing tracks. He of course they do. All rappers play the fucking backing tracks now. That's whack. 
Literally, his track is just playing, and my man's like, of course it drink, is. And he's like, and I'm like, of that course is not it what is. I want. That's When's the last me... hip hop show you went to? Other than a friend of yours? No, or like more underground, like atmosphere. As much as I'm not a atmosphere is not an underground rapper. Fuck Good live here. show rapper. Great, he's a fucking mainstream rapper at this point. Okay, well the point is that when is the last? That's show. not what I asked you. When the last time you went? To a fucking rap show where someone so didn't have a backing track. That was horrible. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm just saying. I don't. All these fucking clowns use backing tracks. I all get of it, them. but all if you're using them. a backing track and you're keeping to it, fine. But it just kind of takes away when no, you stop. No, it's not sit even. Down. Shows aren't even fucking show. They're not performances anymore. They're parties. They're fucking karaoke parties. We live in the age of the internet where people can lip sync a song and get fucking seven million retweets. I'm about to sell my tickets. Yeah, you should have not ever bought them shit. Sorry, Kodak. I I like like seven songs that you've made. I like right? everything. I like all the new shit. No, oh, dude. Kodak, what? I'm sorry. I just like listening dude. to this chopper music. Dude. I'm gonna kill him today. He didn't have a button in his office. Oh, God, you shit. <laughs> Matt Lauer says that's not true. Does he? I mean, kind of. Yeah, I saw sort of his apology. Well, Alright. Um. Jesus, I just like ripped the. Made for La. Hey, dude, chill with the boxes today, my G. Who's La? Size 13. It's LA. Okay. <laughs> sort of a cool and dry place. Place, that's plastic. Oh, these are nice. Huh? This side in. Mm -hmm. This side in, I like that. So it says? Yeah. Oh, uh, funny. Oh, it's like suede. They're pretty cool. Huh, that's crazy. And then it's got the number. Oh, the insert. The insert. Tell you which way to put your foot in in case you don't know. I like this. Store in a cool dry place. I mean, this is kind of though, like, I'm not gonna even like front in any way, I shape, think I or agree. form. You're not even saying but it This yet. is kind of a little bit of a fucking nibble bite off the whole Virgil thing. Yeah, dude. Let's be serious. I mean, I get it. Too, like, yeah, it's a bite. <laughs> yeah, it's a total bite. It's a total bite. The directional arrows, the... Yeah. How would they even think no one's gonna notice? They like, don't care. <laughs> <laughs> There's 200 of them, so they're like, yeah, whatever. It's complex con. And it almost is. feels like this isn't the same PK, though. It feels a little stiffer. They're cool. They're gonna get fucking wrecked in like one day. Nice. Like literally the first day I wear them, they're fucking done. <laughs> so people keep tweeting me because this all spiked last night. There is. Why do they have December spelled D-I-C though? I guess all of this happened. There's like 50 pairs that fucking sold on StockX. Damn. 456 pairs now, but I think like 50, at least 50 sold since yesterday or something. I wonder because dudes are getting them in hand and realizing how hot they are. What? Cause someone's buying them. Right now, so hold on a second. Your theory right now is that the people got them in hand, realize how hot they are and are selling them. Oh no, that wouldn't work. I was thinking that people are realizing how hot they are so everyone's trying to buy them. Yeah, why do you think people are tweeting me saying this? What, how hot they are? Yeah, why? Why do you think that I'm mentioned in this comment? I'm going to fucking tackle you in a second. Because you did the video last yes, night. Yes, which is the entire point of this thing about So right now, now people are buying them. Which means they're selling. I think we're on the same page. No, here. we're nowhere near. We're not even the same motherfucking <laughs> library. <laughs> we're not even. Yeah. No. No. I'm, no, sir. You're on a fucking. You're, you're reading, saying you did you're the video. pages by candlelight, and I got a Kindle. That's what's happening. You're saying you did the video. They look hot, kids. I'm. I'm not saying. What I'm saying is that other people are saying that me making a video about the shoes has made the resale. That's yes, what I'm saying. That's exactly. That's what, I'm saying. what this. That's what this tweet right here says. What you just said was that the people are getting them in hand and that's why they're selling because they've realized they're hot. I don't understand. Yeah, no, yeah. maybe that was wrong. But I maybe. think what I'm saying. Huh. I'm not an asshole. I am not I, an asshole. <laughs> I swear. I'm not. I roll think, a blunt, roll a blunt, please roll I'm a blunt. pretty high anyway. Oh, I'm, I'm not. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm not even trying to take credit for it. I'm only 
reporting what has been reported to me all morning. That's it. Before anybody tries to tell me that I've sent me a four page email about how I think I'm God for real or something. I don't know, man. There's also like some not really like good things with flying with bulldogs. Why don't you call the doctor? Yeah. Because he actually knows Omar. What's it saying? Just saying like some places Pressure like even like banned short-nosed dogs from being even in the cabin because they're more likely to die on the plane, which if there's even a fucking like chance, chance we're not bringing yeah. him. Yeah, like yeah. it's not happening. Here. To talk to you to see if there was anything I needed to be concerned about with just flying with a bulldog or him in general. If you could, please call me back. Thank you, have a fabulous day. Now I fucked him up. What? Because now his, he'll drop immediately because he's yeah, waiting for yeah. the off, like Yeah, he won't even hold on to it now. Oh, he just wants what you have. Exactly, and that's what makes <laughs> But Stupid ass noise, come here. <laughs> well, there you go. That's a good boy. And now instead of off, try and play more so that he still values it. I want to play. He could care less right now. Couldn't. Couldn't care less. A little less than everybody. This is like... My grandmother me, used to drive. Drives me crazy. It's like it's Teddy and I are going somewhere, not Teddy That's and me. That's whatever. That doesn't bother me. What? Teddy and I and Teddy and me are grand. Couldn't and could completely change the tone and fucking demeanor of your sentence. Whether it's a double negative. I could not. care less means that you actually have the capacity to care less. Like, hey, I could care less. Like, you know what I'm saying? I couldn't care less means I have no capacity to give a fuck about what you're talking about. Do you understand the difference? I do understand the difference. I can't <laughs> think of which one I want for this You situation. want, I couldn't, if it's something that you do not like, yeah. then you couldn't care less. If it's something that doesn't affect you, like, hey, these two people got married, like, I couldn't care less if those So I couldn't people. care less if he wanted to play. No, you said he couldn't. He couldn't, he couldn't care, care less. less. Means that he has no, like, he is showing you that in no way does he care. There is no room for him to show you that he could care any less than he does right now. Yes. But what you're saying when you say, I could care less, Means that he actually could care a little bit less than he does right now. Like, he's kind of into it, but I could care less. You know, does that make sense? Yes. Like, if you're driving with one hand, <laughs> right? Yeah. And you, I could care less would mean take your hand off the wheel. Because now you care less about your safety than you did prior to. Does that yeah. make sense? Yes. I was, my mind's blown. I'm done. <laughs> okay. All that weed, and then you come in here and tell me about cooking. We're going to play a video game, I guess. <laughs> and then I'm going to draw. I mean, let's play a video game. I could care less. If we play a video game. Right? <laughs> now you don't even know. I couldn't care it less. It isn't even applicable now. <laughs> it's Friday. Yep. And you were going to get tattooed. Yeah, we didn't even know it was Friday. We didn't Friday. realize it was actually Friday. Wait, maybe next week. Maybe Monday. Yeah. Cool. And now we just finished playing Call of Duty. I'm starving. I'm going to get lunch with Ern. And then I'm going to be drawing for... Oh, yeah. We got food. It's on food. And then I'm gonna draw the on whites because they're white. Yeah. I'm <laughs> like, dog, were you recording this whole time? No, no. I wish I was. No. I didn't know that the elevator. My fucking goddamn heart just dropped. I was like, you what? You thought we were stuck. I, I know, know. that's why I turned it off. This is it. Oh, that'd be great for the vlog. No. I'm gonna get us. I'm gonna set it up like a prank ahead of time. We're gonna go to some public building where you think it's normal, and then the elevator's gonna fail. So I could do it on an escalator, but it wouldn't have the same effect. No, not quite. All right, what is up, everybody? It has been quite a day. I've been drawing for like, almost even forgot that I had to edit the vlog. It's uh, way later than normal for me. It's almost six o'clock, so. Drawing, 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 getting ready for all the stuff going on in life. Holidays are approaching. New York City sneaker con is approaching. All kinds of things approaching. Life, life just, you know, life just stays approaching. Uh, let's see, AI drop. There's an AI drop on Sunday, 10 a.m. Mountain Time. Dropping the OG color runway, which sold out last time super quick. There's a new colorway of the runner, and there is also the new AI logo. T-shirts, crewnecks, and hoodies all go online Sunday, 10 a.m. Mountain Time. We'll see you there. But yeah, got everything ready. Everything's ready to go, ready to get shipped as soon as you order it. Because as I've discussed, we had some shipping issues a couple of weeks ago, but now we're back on track. Uh, we also have something pretty awesome coming right before Christmas. So 
be ready. Shoes, shoes today. Nothing really came in the mail. I had a delayed package from UPS and I got sad about it, but it's okay. But my tan Pharrells are supposed to be here today, but it's gonna be Monday, but that's okay. So many shoes have come in the mail. I haven't even gotten a chance to wear some of the pairs of Pharrells that I do have. So I'm not complaining, just so we're clear. Um, but what did come in today, which is interesting cop. So um, I didn't go to Complex Con, as everyone who watches this channel knows. Insane to me, it looks crazy. Adidas released three different pairs of shoes. They released this pair, then my hand, and they released an EQT, which a lot of people really like. I haven't seen it in hand. Just looks like it's made of really premium materials, cream colorway. Um, and then they released the Nerd Human Race. Pandemonium seemed like a super big headache just to even be there. Shout out to you if you went there, and shout out to you if you got these shoes and I bought them. I don't know how many hands these have been through yet, but whoever was involved, shout out to you because I got them now and they're here. But yeah, this is what the box looks like. Nice little gray Adidas box. And then it says, made for LA. The shoe came inside, oh, well, the box was wrapped in this bag, as you saw. And then the shoes came inside this bag, as you saw. And then this is the shoe itself. So City Socks, uh, every, anybody, again, anyone who watches the channel knows I love City Socks. This is no exception as far as how it fits. I think it's great. So City Sock, pretty much just like an NMD, you can wear your true size or you can size down. It's a 100% PK upper. This one is basically all crispy white, but there is actually cream stitched in between each white line. You can really see it on the collar in certain lights. I don't really think you can see it in here, but trust me when I tell you that there's cream stitched into it as well. Uh, big differences on this one, you have one white brick, one blue brick, bleh. one blue, what? One white brick and one blue brick. And also the first thing that popped in my mind is that somewhat of a companion to this shoe, just sort of reversed. Somewhat of a companion to this shoe, but not really, more of just like, a branding thing. Adidas is heavy with the blue and white branding and it seemed like they were rolling with it heavy, heavy at Complex Con. Uh, style code is actually on the outside of the shoe. The knitting to me feels like it's a little bit more sturdy than the previous, like especially around the collar, but I can't really tell. It might be because this one's warm, but this just, just feels just a little, it's a little different, not crazy. The insole that is non-removable has these arrows telling you which direction to put your foot. The left shoe says this side in on the panel, and the inside panel on this is like straight up this thick panel of suede. This is like just buttery, buttery suede. Back NMD tab, which normally has Adidas branding, says to store this in a cool and dry place. And then the right shoe has 41090 in the middle. Wait, which one is the goddamn? What the hell does 41090 mean? I have no idea. Um, and then this one has like a blue sort of insole color. There's no insole, but with the arrows. So, well, I think one of, oh, and the inside says made for LA. I don't know if you can really see this but it says made for LA in there. Um, but yeah, so I'm glad I got this cop. It's, they're gonna get destroyed. Like as soon as I wear them outside, these are a done deal. You know, these are gonna have to be like, let's just face it, you know, and it's not, it wasn't super cheap. I paid like 360 resale for these just because there's, um, there's only 200 of them in the world. So I pretty much wanted to get them. But um, yeah, it's an interesting thing. As I said, when I unboxed it, the whole, I don't know what this 41090 stands for. It's gonna drive me crazy. But, but you know, like this um, store in a cool, dry place and the whole whatever the hell this number means and then this side in and the direction to put your foot in and then the box you know the let this sort of presentation with even this font is very reminiscent of the Virgil off-white tin I mean I'm just gonna say it uh, whatever you know what I mean like so it's not my favorite concept honestly because of that and it's no shade to Virgil or the off-white collab but I just think that that's kind of it's kind of silly kind of silly to have like bitten that just even a little bit because it's so noticeable it kind of bums me out a little bit I didn't know anything about any of this stuff on the shoe so to me you know if this had come out separately or another at a different time it probably wouldn't like remind me so much but because Virgil and off-white it's pretty much like mentioned every day to me still because finally Nike did something we're talking about to some to people to more than five people. Sorry, sorry, I can't stop myself. Yeah, it's uh 
It's weird. It's a weird move. It's a very strange move, especially for complex con. But yeah, whatever. I mean, there's 200 of them. That's that's all that some people need to hear. And I guess that day I was one of them. So but I will wear them. They'll definitely get worn, but they're going to get destroyed. Let's just be serious. There's no way to keep this crispy white. <laughs> definitely not a must cop because there's only 200 of them. And um, yeah, unless you plan on going to like a white. I don't know. This is like an NMD city. This is like a, it's just so crispy. It's like for heaven. You know what I'm saying? I might just save these for my funeral. And that way when someone else is putting my shoes on, they know which foot to put them on with all the directions and stuff. But uh, yeah, here you go. Complex Con City Socks. My G's and GF's. This has been called the Oddities Pack, which I'm assuming is their labeling of all of the outside writing and such because it's kind of odd. All right, so I'm out of here. That's the week. I can't believe it's Friday. I thought that it was Thursday when I woke up. So I got the weekend. I will be basically, I know you're gonna hear a broken record. I'll be drawing all weekend. Got to clean my house Saturday. The serious cleaning going on. And then, um, yeah, we'll be back. I'll be on live stream here and there for the weekend. And once again, sorry for everybody in London for not making it. I'll see you guys soon. All right, peace.